Hey, two videos in a row. It must be Christmas. <laughs> so why to even use Yabritz? Because obviously you can just launch those standalone uh, amp sims, you know, uh, using using wine. Well, let me show why you need Yabritz. It's obviously about the latency, because when you're playing guitar and the signal goes through your system and comes back to your ear, that's round trip latency. So if the round trip latency is uh, way over 10 milliseconds, let's go 15, 20, something like that, then it really, really starts affect your playing and, and it becomes increasingly hard to actually play anything. Uh, for me, the threshold is around 10 milliseconds. I, uh, if I get there, it's uh, it's already perfect for me. And I get that with buffer size 128 with 48 kilohertz sampling rate. I get around to uh, six or seven milliseconds using using 64, but I just find it unnecessary. The lower buffer size you go, the more unstable it becomes because then you're starting getting like like these X runs and stuff like that. Uh, dropouts and that all depends on the plugin load and how uh, good processor your computer has and, and so on and so on. I have now hardwired from my audio interface just a normal guitar cable going from my input one to the output two and uh, I have a LSP latency meter plugin here which sends a signal to my audio interface output that then obviously comes by the hardwire back to the input and then the latency meter can measure a pulse how long does it take and that is the round trip latency it goes through everything you know the the hardware the drivers everything uh and that's the actual experience of the latency that you will get so if i just um, open up this uh, ui it opened on a different screen there there it is and if i click measure it sends a pulse and it tells me that my system not having anything here in between has 9.3 9.4 millisecond round trip latency now, I've loaded the Archetype Kojira here to Kala, which is running through Yabridge. If we put the latency meter going through the Kojira, like so, and um, measure it again, it does add a little bit of latency. So now, now it's around 12 milliseconds. And when I was playing yesterday, I uh, this is... Uh, I, I didn't notice even this yesterday. I guess, you know, with a good day, I actually probably could notice it. Uh, but um, yeah, it's it's very very reasonable, and you know you, you can get it lower if you go lower buffer size. Uh, so then it's probably around I don't know eight milliseconds or seven something like that. Anyway, so what if we instead of having the Kojira loaded here in Kala, and in this case it's running on top of Yabritz session, so Yabritz is kind of hosting the whole thing here, and that's why you have. Uh, have a reasonable latency. Now let's do the same thing except that I'm actually now running the actual standalone uh, Kojira plugin. So it is in my Wine environment, which is uh, uh, the, the installer that I showed in my previous video does this Wine YB environment under your home folder. And there is there you have your basically your uh, kind of like a mock-up of your Windows system, which is the Drive C, program files, neural, amp, uh, neural DSP, and there's the uh, art stack with Jira. And here you have the executable. So if I run it here, and here's, here's the, also the warning related to my previous video, is that uh, if I would now run this with the system wine, it would actually affect this Yabritz wine setup here, and it could potentially break it. So I definitely want to run it with my Yabritz wine setup here. Um, so then it uses the same wine version that I actually created this whole. Uh, this is called the wine prefix system. So uh, now it's loaded there and it should probably pop up. Yeah, here it is. So uh, we have it. Uh, oh, sorry, it's not that one. That was the one in Kala. It's this one here. Uh, so I will just disconnect all the outputs and I will just put this one now here, like so. So same thing, same thing, but the difference is that this is now loaded in uh, a full on wine session without having the updates there in between. And if you know, Check the latency. It's a freaking hundred milliseconds. It's it's like on a totally unplayable level. So this is something that you just you know <laughs> you you cannot do anything with latency like this. So this is why you why you need uh, need the operates. Again, if I if I uh, disconnect from there, and I put it the one that I have hosted in Kala, eleven. So it is like uh, tenfold better. This is why you need Yabridge. Thanks. Bye.